Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and a Life Path number seven. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this reading. So today everyone, I am here with a channel messages reading from your person for all of my Geminis who are watching. So if you have Gemini as your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, then this reading may resonate or apply to you. So Gemini, your person is whoever is currently on your mind right now. You two may be in separation and communication at a distance from one another. Just whoever in your heart is your person, that's your person, and you'll know. Before I do go ahead and get started, Gemini, please keep in mind that this is a general reading for the sign of Gemini, so it may not resonate or relate to you specifically, and if it does not, please don't take it personally. Alright, Gemini, so with that being said, let's go ahead and begin your reading. First, what I'm going to do is pull some of my specific channel messages for you all so let's get in touch with the energy you're dealing with or the energy that is coming towards you all right can we please get a few cards for my gemini's who's this person that gemini is dealing with currently and how do they truly feel towards gemini what energy all right, we have a second card that came out, Gemini. What other energy do we have making its way towards Gemini? What's this person's true feelings and emotions, please, when it comes to Gemini? Okay, so two cards came out with that pull. This card was already on our spread. Let's take one of these cards, Gemini. We'll take this card. I'll read this as an extra message. There's so much curiosity I have when it comes to you. All right. So we have four cards so far. Let's go ahead and get two more specific messages, please, for Gemini. What else do we need to know here, please? Let's get one more card. What else do we need to know for now for my Geminis when it comes to this person and their energy? All right, Gemini, so let's go ahead and leave it at that for now. Before I do go ahead and begin your reading, please keep in mind that any energy, feelings, emotions, actions that I describe from your person, that could be how you feel here, the roles could be reversed. Just however this reading resonates for you, please only take what resonates out of this reading, Gemini. All right, so let's start with this card. It says, I can't wait to discover everything there is about you. Let's clear this up before we get lost. I know how my love feels once I'm invested. I need to make sure you're ready. I feel like you are my reflection. I want to be better for me so I could be better for you. And I have a lot of love to give, but I don't want to give it away freely. Okay, Gemini, so I do feel like this is someone you already know, um, someone that you want to speed up the process with and someone that you want everything to come together with as smoothly as possible or for it to really match your, your dreams when it comes to this person or just your optimism and how much potential you see within this person and this connection. But it kind of seems like this person has been moving aimlessly or you feel as though this connection is moving aimlessly so it may have started to have you wonder or guess like where is this going to lead to is this going to amount to anything and I feel like for some time Gemini maybe this is you now but you haven't been pressuring this person you've been enjoying getting to know them enjoying the process but there is a certain point in time that we reach within ourselves when we're like, okay, what's next? Or, okay, I know I deserve more than this. 
So I, I feel like that's where you're at now, Gemini, and you're just hoping that this person is going to come through or this isn't all just a waste of time. Um, let's go ahead and start with this first card. I can't wait to discover everything there is about you. I feel like this is your energy, Gemini. Of course, this person could definitely feel the same way towards you, but I feel like you've already thought about the possibilities and... I'm going to tie this card into this card as well. I feel like you are my reflection. Just seeing so many similarities. Also, differences between you two, but those differences will help you expand as people and help you grow together. So the fact that you could really fit this person into your lifestyle, it, it makes you excited, Gemini. So just thinking about where this connection could take you to and... When you two are at that that spot in this connection, how amazing you would feel. So really thinking into the future with this person. We have, I have a lot of love to give, but I don't want to give it away freely. I feel like this is your energy, Gemini. And you may have not always felt this way, but I feel like this is after time and time of putting in your efforts, your love, your energy, and not getting the same in return or being given the bare minimum. Um, it's not a cost for you to show your love, Gemini, but you do want to feel seen as well. You want to feel reassured, and it's like this person hasn't been doing that or yeah, they haven't been doing that or you know the love that you deserve, Gemini, and it's just not cutting it. This could also be this person just being nonchalant or putting you on the back burner and it makes you feel like your efforts or your presence doesn't really matter. We have, I know how my love feels once I'm invested. I need to make sure you're ready. Your energy, Gemini, and this might be the stage you're in right now you're already invested here but if you were to continue to put in your love and you're not being shown it back then you know how that'll make you feel so I feel like if anything you are putting a stop at things or you're just maintaining your distance from this person that doesn't mean you're wanting to close it off completely but you're protecting yourself you're watching out for you Gemini so, yeah, this is for you, Gemini, and for you not to get pulled in too deep here. So we have, I want to be better for me so I could be better for you. I feel like this is this person's energy, Gemini. Maybe they have acknowledged to themselves or maybe to you as well, Gemini, that there are some things that they need to work on. And sometimes people need to go through things and solve things individually or on their own so that they could so that they could get it themselves because at the end of the day a person is going to want to only because of themselves so I, I feel like maybe this is the energy of this person and there are some things whether it be externally or in inwardly that they need to work on and figure out because also, Gemini, if you want to help them through whatever they're going through, if they're not ready to fully take on that challenge, what you're helping them with, it, it might affect you as well. So sometimes it's good or it's better to separate yourself from people when, when you are working on you, Gemini. And of course, not all the time. You could still accept help. But it really depends on where this person is at, how they view themselves, Gemini. So if anything, I feel like it's it's them, not you. And we have, let's clear this up before we get lost. So I feel like the both of you want to maintain this sense of connection still, even if you two aren't on, aren't on a straight onward hill, Gemini. Um... This person also doesn't want you to be that one that got away. You've always been a good person to them, Gemini. 
And maybe, like, if you stepped away from this person, Gemini, and you were waiting on them and they had yet to come through still, maybe you already turned your back from this person and went the opposite way. All right, Gemini, let's go ahead and get the few or a few more messages for you. What else do we need to know here for my Geminis, please? All right, Gemini, so... Let's take this card. Two cards came out. We'll read this as an extra message. I want to come. I want you to come everywhere with me. I feel better with you by my side. All right. Let's go ahead and get another message, please, for Gemini. We'll just get two more messages please what else do we need to know here let's get one more card please for Gemini all right Gemini so we have our last few messages and we'll pull some situations oracle cards we have you are one of a kind I would be blessed to have you by my side I was a coward for hurting you. I know I'll never regain your trust. We never see eye to eye. A relationship requires compromise. And nostalgia is hard to face when it comes to you. So yeah, Gemini, we'll start with this card. I feel like this is your emotions, how you feel towards this person. They could be feeling the same way if this is like over with Gemini like this has brought you too much pain and you have to choose yourself but as far as your energy Gemini it's like as much as you wanted it to work out there was not much you could do or not much else you could do without hurting yourself and bring your excuse me bringing yourself through the motions and it's like you already faced that with this person, so you didn't want to do too much else to hurt your own feelings. So it's like you could think about the good times, the, the bad times, and also what could have come out of it. But sometimes it's just best to keep things as a memory or just to remember it as an experience. We never see eye to eye, a relationship requires compromise. So yeah, Gemini, there may have been some stubbornness going on from this person's side, or it's like you would come through for them, you would accommodate their needs, their wants, but when it came to you, it was like it was the toughest, the toughest <laughs> thing ever. So just not fair to you, Gemini. Um, so yeah, someone not, not willing to work with you here i was a coward for hurting you i know i'll never regain your trust i feel like this is this person's energy gemini and you tried to keep things like loving and light-hearted i feel like that's what came out of you gemini but this person still acted cold or they acted like they didn't have any care for you or it could also be the type of person like things are good between you two but when they're upset they're the meanest person ever and you don't deserve that and we have you are one of a kind i would be blessed to have you by my side this is for you gemini i feel like this is how this person feels about you gemini but it it may be too late for that this love was long overdue um and yeah, it's like as much as you may want this to work out, maybe you can remember majority of the times where things did not work out between you two and when things weren't the best and when this person wasn't the best for you. Let's see what situations, Oracle cards we have, Gemini. What energy do we have going for Gemini, please? All right, we have access granted, social media, fake profile, hiding. 
Let's get another card for Gemini, please. What else do we need to know here? We have drastic, extreme, harsh, cut off. All right, can we get one more card, please, for Gemini? We have soulmate, similar friendship, romantic partner. So Gemini, these cards can resonate specifically like for you um, personally, or they could resonate um, within or they could resonate with this energy that we do have. So only take these cards as they resonate for you. But access granted social media, fake profile hiding, perhaps there was something you found out on social media, Gemini. This person may have been having like a double life somewhat maybe a separate social media account and you discovered a lot more on that account i feel like someone cut someone off drastically i do feel like it may have been this person gemini as far as like them just stop them stopping communicating with you so we have drastic extreme harsh cut off and soulmate, similar friendship, romantic partner. I feel like this is what you maybe saw in this person, Gemini. And looking back at it, this is what they see in you. Like you were, there was nothing wrong with you, Gemini. You were everything great to them. Let's see what sign you might be dealing with here. We have Leo. Let's get another sign for Gemini, please. Pisces, one more sign, please and Aries. So we have Leo, Pisces, Aries, but Gemini, I'm going to go ahead and leave it at that for today. As always, I appreciate the love and support. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you next time. Bye.